today, I just got this. It's a queen ant, who in this video will be giving birth to an entire colony, and they're gonna be put to the test against my simulations of real world events. But currently, she's alone, and she needs to care for her eggs until they hatch into worker ants. And thankfully, it didn't take very long until just that happened. The first worker was born. You see, these are trap jaw ants, a species of ant that has these massive mandibles to cut their prey in half. But they're also absolutely massive compared to normal ants, and the workers are almost the same size as the queens. And in the world of ants, the workers have only one purpose, to serve the queen. Workers do almost everything for the queens, including cleaning her and even caring for the other eggs. But I want to make my colony grow extra fast, and you do that by feeding them food. And since it's so small with just two ants, let's just start with a single drop of honey. Hopefully they like it. So I slid the drop of honey into the tube for the ants to eat. And almost instantly, the worker went up to investigate this unknown object. She smelled around it for a second, but then went back to the queen to report the findings. The worker is able to communicate with the queen by rubbing its antenna against hers. When they do this, it releases some pheromone, signaling that it found some honey. And after the queen gave the go-ahead, the worker traveled back to the honey. But instead of eating it, the worker actually knocked the little plate over, and then the honey soaked into the sand over the next 10 minutes. Yeah, she didn't even try to eat it, actually. You see, it turns out the ant did this for a reason. When a colony is this small, the queen will feed the workers by regurgitating its body tissues into their mouth. This means the colony already had enough food for now. I was gonna have to wait till more ants hatched until they wanted extra food. So, that's exactly what I did. There were now four workers a part of the colony, and their roles were becoming a lot more apparent. Two of them-